excited I am right now. <laughs> um, because I'm actually not that excited. Um, welcome everyone to my channel, youtube.com slash Dance. Hopefully, we are very close to the 31 more viewer or subscribers. And if you guys are new to the channel, please go ahead and hit subscribe. You know how much it helps me out because we're so close to getting that 100 mark so we can get our own custom URL. Now, I'm going to just say flat out, um, I'm not 100% excited for this game. I have played the game in full disclosure. I played the demo that was traveling around everywhere. I'll make a video about that as well. Um, but I, I wasn't super blown away with it. And I still bought it. I still picked it up. Not only because I'm such a diehard Pokemon fan. Uh, I mean, Team Instinct up in here. But... I, I really just I wanted to give it a shot. I don't want to be completely biased in one. Well, it's not even one. The whole game hasn't seemed that appealing to me, but I want to rectify that. I want I want to give the game a chance. Is what I'm saying. Press. Yep. This is the controller I want to use. I'm gonna go ahead and confirm that. Joy cons in hands. And yeah, if you guys do end up playing, enjoying this first video. Okay, shit. Th that that screen got me. Just that screen by itself. No. <laughs> Pikachu. It's a female. Pikachu. <laughs> that face is always enough to tell me. Fuck, what have I done? <laughs> Alright, so we're going to be playing in English. Um, that's about it. Hi there. I, I am a very big sucker for nostalgia. Hello there! Glad to meet you! Welcome to the world of Pokemon! My name is Oak. People affectionately refer to me as the Pokemon Professor. I sound like, just like him from the fucking uh, Pokemon Go videos. This world is inhabited far and wide by creatures called Pokemon. And if you want to know how people tend to interact with these Pokemon, well, some people keep them as companions, as for myself. <laughs> Why did that one have such a long one? I study Pokemon as a profession. Now, why don't you tell me about yourself? Alright, what do I look like? Oh, I didn't realize there was customer c er, customization in this. You know what? I would love to have this skin tone with those eyes. Um, but, you know, that'll do. And how about the name? Um, of course, we gotta, we gotta go with Taco. Why would we do anything else? I'm gonna sneeze. <coughs> Thank you. <laughs> right, so your name is Taco. <laughs> hey, it's a rival. This boy here is your friend and rival who has grown up right next door to you. What was his name now? Um, now, I'm going to give a very, very big shout out to a friend that no longer does YouTube. Uh, rest in peace. But he went by the name of Andrew Gaming, and uh, Andrew will always be the rival, even if he stopped with Pokemon. He's been my friend since like seventh grade, so <laughs> shout outs to Andrew. Mm hmm, I see. His name is Andrew. Hey, Pika, you want to get out of my face? Taco, my boy! Your very own Pokemon tale is about to unfold. Yes, a world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon awaits. Let's go. Goodbye, Pikachu, jumping right into my TV. Oh my gosh. <laughs> hey. Oh, I was going to say, am I playing with a blue one? I'm playing with a red one. Which makes sense. The blue one's on the table. Oh, oh wait. No, no, it doesn't make sense anymore. I thought he'd have it in his hand. God, what, what kind of Dell computer are you running, my dude? Hey, the Nidorino versus Gengar from the title 
What? What is that? <gasps> That's the the old sprite for like a ride on and uh, those the gym statues. Oh my gosh, this is already full of Easter eggs and stuff. I mm, don't do this to me, Nintendo. Come on. So can we play the game on here? It's a Nintendo Switch. It's connected to the TV. Um, do you have an item for us, computer? Email from Andro. Hey, Taco. So here's what you need to know as a trainer. All right. So this is also not like a normal game. Um, not a normal Pokemon game, I should say. There's no battling the wild Pokemon. You just catch them. And that's kind of been like a really low point for me, in my opinion. Hey! Morning, Taco. Uh, what's going on? You got one weird look on your face. Yeah, because you look like crap. Where's Gary, dude? Uh, never mind that. I couldn't wait any longer, so I came to get you. Today's finally the big day. We're finally going to get our first Pokemon from Professor Oak and become real trainers. Oh, before we do... You read the email I sent you yesterday, right? Yeah, I already did. I skimmed it. Um, <laughs> I'm going to book it to Professor Oak's lab, so I'll see you there. Alright, well, I'll see you there too. Let's go. Oh, I like the TV we got. Is that our mom? Are you our mom? Oh, you're not at all what I imagined you'd look like, but you know what? Uh, I get that's not a bad thing. Hi there. Am I not gonna wave back and being rude? Oh, tell me that's a technology is amazing guy. I'm gonna go talk to him right now. Hi there. Technology is incredible, and I can connect your smartphone to your game console and send data between them. Which, I will make a tutorial on how to do that. Trust me. Alright, what's poppin', dude? Oh, Taco, Professor Oak isn't here. Do you think those Pokeballs hold the Pokemon you and I are supposed to get? Can't wait to get mine. Oh, there's only two. There's no three of them. Ooh, let's go. Let's go run into the grass. God damn it. See, I'm getting excited over this, and, like, I initially wasn't excited for the game. Ugh. <laughs> Nintendo, please. Hey. Well, good, my Pidgey. Thanks for the help. Hey, Oak. I can't go into the tall grass. There's wild Pokemon out there. I think I understand you all a bit better now. Thanks to this. Ah, if it isn't Taco. Ooh, turn it up on my headset. No, I'm kidding. Oh, of course. I promised to give you and Andrew your Pokemon today, didn't I? Well, in that case, why don't we head over to... Hmm? Yeah, what's this? It's a Pikachu. A female at that. Ooh, our first battle with Pikachu right here and right now. Oh, you encountered the wild Pikachu. My, my. I surely wouldn't have expected a Pikachu to come around here. But since opportunity has presented itself, why don't we practice Pokemon catching? So this is what I was referring to, where it's literally like Pokemon Go, you want to well, look at that tutorial right then and there. I suck at this really bad, by the way. I played the demo and I just could not, I could not do it. Mm. But I bet this first one lets you catch it right away. God, this game looks phenomenal. I like... I like what they've done with the place. Really tidied up Nintendo. Kinda had to though, I mean. <laughs> that was pretty fine performance for a first time, my boy. Why don't you pick up that Pokeball and give the po Pikachu your cartoon name? Alright, so... What's in the... <laughs> Yo, can you just control a Pokeball from the inside like that? Now that's a lively Pokemon if I ever seen one. I have no idea what the accent is anymore. Hey, wait, come back! Professor Oak! These Pokeballs there, I swear there were only two a second ago, but now there are three. A perfectly reasonable reaction, my boy! You see, one of them is a Pikachu that Taco caught just now. So wait, Taco, you caught it yourself? Yeah, it's mine. Give it to me. 
What? I've never seen that happen before. Ho ho ho! How interesting! Well, my boy, this is it! Take that Pokeball and keep a good hold of it this time. Wait, so I want to choose the other ones. I think it's trying to tell you that you're going for the wrong one, pal. I, I guess so. I don't really have a choice then. Hey, 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 I'm liking this. That's a Kodak moment. Capture taken. I love it. <laughs> I had to, guys. I'm sorry. I need a thumbnail. <laughs> Pikachu became your Pokemon. Hmm, that was a strange Pokemon indeed. It sure doesn't seem to like staying in one place, but it looks as though it's taken a shrine to you, Taco. Why not give it a name? Would you like to give Pikachu a name? Um, I'm going to name it after um, a Pokemon that doesn't appear until second gen. But basically, in the second generation of the Pokemon anime, um, Ash has a, another rival, and that rival also has a Pikachu, which I will gladly name after that one Sparky. <laughs> Professor, I choose this one. Andrew got an Eevee from Professor Oak. So what is the third option then? Will we ever know? Are they going to make a third Pokemon game? Alright, he just jumped into me. Oh, that's adorable. Oh, well. Oh, just one more thing. Not that you two are setting out as trainers. I'd like to ask you with your help for something. Take these on your journeys. These what? These nuts! Okay. <laughs> what is that thing, Professor? This is the Pokedex that I've designed! It automatically records data on any Pokemon you've seen or caught, and it makes an entry for each. It's an extremely high-tech tool! Taco and Andro. <laughs> okay, hold up. That, that, this little thing right here is tugging at my heartstrings so bad. I miss you, Andy. Come back. <laughs> I want you... Each to take one with you. You got a Pokedex from Professor Oak. Hey. You'll find that you can't get every detailed data on Pokemon just by seeing them. You must catch a Pokemon to gather the most complete data. To make a complete guide to all the Pokemon in the world. That was my dream. I'm an old man now. Too old to get the job done myself. That's why I want you young trainers to fulfill my dream for me. Get moving, you two. This is a great undertaking in Pokemon history. Pokedex, huh? Well, we're gonna meet so many Pokemon. This keeps things getting better. <laughs> These things just keep getting better and better. And you're not gonna battle me? That's different. Usually, uh, there's a battle right here, right now. Before we even leave the lab. Hey, Mom. Meet my Pikachu. Oh, how cute. This is the one you've got from the professor? What? You got it yourself? That's amazing. What should I call your new friend? Sparky? It's a lovely Pokemon. Oh, how energetic. I suppose that means you two will be setting off on an adventure today, right? I thought this date might come so soon. So I planned ahead and got this for you. A town map for mom. We're not getting it from Gary's sister? Come on, I gotta go visit that piece of ass. No, <laughs> Safe travels, dear. You and Sparky be good to each other. We'll try, Mama. We'll try. Um. God, this game looks beautiful. So the Pokemon are just out here in the overworld. Um, hi there. I don't recall receiving any Pokeballs, so I don't think we can catch it. Oh, we have 50 Pokeballs to start? Ooh, let's throw this Pokeball. See, this was, that right there was my biggest problem with this game, is I can throw the device, the Joy-Con, and there's still like two-thirds of a second of lag 
and that bugs me so much <laughs> because you have to be precise with it. As soon as that circle gets small, that's when you have to throw the controller or make the Ooh, 3D models and everything. That's when you have to make the. Uh, what do you? Have? Okay, so, yeah, <laughs> I was confused for a second. I had to make the toss. Oh my god, you appeared out of nowhere. Ah! So you almost have to throw it like ahead of time. Um, and I can't say I'm a, feature, a fan of that feature. Eh. Maybe I'm nitpicking, but... Uh, whatever. Also, all the Pokemon get experience now? Wow, you're making it way too easy. Hello? Can't accept this. Hello. <laughs> no, get away from me, <laughs> Pikachu! No, wait. What are you doing, Pika? Pika P? Pika P. Found something in the plants. A raspberry from Sparky. Thank you. All right. I didn't know that was a thing. Oh, he's so small. I love it. Oh, you're stuck on that part too? I wonder if he still gives those Dream Eater. I swear to God, I thought for a second this was Stan Lee. And I was like, too soon. Too soon. Oh. I know who you two are. I'm gonna steal your mouth. Uh, what are you doing here? Twerp or shoe? Go pester someone else. What do you want? You can't pass through here right now. Alright, so there's no more drunk man. And is there a particle effect going on in this game? There is. It's very, very light, but... What's up, Pika? What'd you find now? Found something that was dropped in the flower bed. A pretty wing. Oh, okay. Thank you. We found the pretty wing. But does the pretty wing do the same thing in other games? Um, pretty wing. It's just a regular feather and has no effect. Yep. <laughs> yep, that's exactly what it does. Hey, you came for Palatown? That's no Professor Oak, right? I got a delivery for him, but I can't really leave the Pokemon unattended right now. Can I get you to take this to Professor Oak for me? And the parasol came from the Professor or from the Poke Clerk. Thanks, kid. Say hi to Professor for me too. All right, we definitely will. You can just you can just go there. The game literally just teleports you back to the lab. What? This, this is the hand-holding stuff that I don't like in games, yet I clicked it anyways. But, I mean, that, that cannot happen in Gen 8. I will be very upset. Why, Taco, back so soon. How's little Pikachu doing? Hmm? <laughs> back up, Professor. You were too close to my face. Oh, hi, Pika. That was it? Okay. Alright, but I got something for you. Your Uber is here. Goodness me, Pikachu here seems like it really can't come to... Pikachu here seems like it's really come to be a true partner to you. Why was that so difficult to read? I thought this was for children. <laughs> What's that? You have something for me. Oh, my auto arrived. It's a GS ball. You know, the thing that no one in this fucking born in the last 10 years will understand. Hey, Professor Oak, it's about my Eevee. It moves our... Whoa, Taco, that's so cool. Pikachu just rides on you like that? Hey, so does <laughs> your <Yo>, girl? <laughs> no. <laughs> I've just been delivered some very handy items, which I think I'll share with the two of you. That is not what that parasol is. Come on, we know what it is. Where's, where's Celebi? Mm. Great, I've been starving. Oh, wait, that wasn't even <laughs> Professor Oak. All right, so yeah, uh, the items in this game should function pretty similar to how they do in uh, the Pokemon Go app. So, don't really get much for you guys in that regard. And, oh! Wait up! Come on, Taco. You know, you do know you can do more with Pokemon than just catch them, right? If you're a trainer, you can have Pokemon battles, too. I'll show you exactly what I mean. I like that transition. Alright, it's a solid seven and a half transition right there. Alright. Oh, 
Oh, Pikachu is ready to fight! You see that face? Alright, so Andro totally hinted at the fact that his Eevee... His Eevee's level 6, first of all. That's a level higher than what we're used to. Hmm. I love that. Let's the shark. Let's go. Tackle. All right. So who knows? Maybe maybe there is more challenge to this uh, fighting system than I might have given it credit for. So usually, what I do with uh, Pokemon game play walkthroughs, or whatever, is um. I have two copies of the game. The Pokemon Let's Go Eevee Edition is for my girlfriend. So I, if I do uh, end up making another video to this, if you guys would like to, go ahead and drop the support with the subs, with the likes, with the comments. Um, it will be where I pick up in the game, not necessarily right where this video leaves off. Just a little forewarning. Ah, jeez. Ah, oh, jeez, Rick! Morty, Morty, I need you to... I need you to battle these Pokemon, Morty. Uh, Morty. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <laughs> did you enjoy your first taste of battle? I mean, I did back in, like... Way before you were programmed. <laughs> when you were originally programmed. That's when I enjoyed it. Pallet Town. Alright, let's get... All the heck the way I... I don't want to battle this fucking Pidgey. Hey, Taco. Oh, what's up, girl? <laughs> Just look at Pikachu. You two are already looking like great partners. And I've got the perfect little gift for such a great team. Here, you take this. You got sportswear from your friend's big sister. Oh, big sister. What's up, big sister Chan? Uh, you put the sportswear in your... Okay. Should I put it on Pikachu? All right, all right. We're gonna give this a shot. Sparky looks very happy. Uh, partner play. Play with Sparky. You can pet Sparky by placing your hand on it and moving your hand. Z R A button. Okay, okay. So I think this is also how you're supposed to be able to give it haircuts, right? All right. Let me mess up your hair. I want to mess up your hair. <coughs> How do you mess up the hair? Alright, let's give you a berry. Hey! Hey! Don't swat at me. Oh. Who do you think you are, Missy? Pinch your cheeks for that one. Hey! Oh, you're swatting at me because... Uh, um. No, you're just swatting at me! Ass! <laughs> I thought I was doing something wrong. Oh, okay, I poked you. Uh, sorry, that hurt me. <laughs> okay, yeah, I, I think I'm good. So that Pikachu wants to play. Don't forget to show us some love from time to time. Eh, um, the thing I have with this Pikachu is uh, it's just, it's just a real bummer. <laughs> Um, so wow, we have a few options here. Communicate. Mystery gifts play with others. Alright. Uh, are there any mystery gifts at the moment? Get via internet. I'm, I'm curious right now. No gift was found. That's fine. And, uh, boop, 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 boop. Play with Sparky, bag, Pokedex. Alright. I'm content with what I've seen. Yo, did this route change? It has to have changed. I don't, I don't remember it being like this. Yeah, give me the potion. I know you got him! Um, excuse you. Can you... Nope. Nope. There are rats in the grass. And are you a trainer? Are there trainers this early now? Trainer's eyes have met. I'll battle you with my favorite Pokemon. Goodness gracious. Such a, a strong young boy. <laughs> Youngster Ronnie. 
sending out the Rattata. Alright. Wait, was it Ronnie? Wait, I, I had to read that name again. I was kind of hoping it'd be uh, jo Youngster Joey. Why is it not Youngster Joey? Is this a, is this a wrong timeline? Yo, I'm down. Irish. Everyone gains experience. Youngster Ronnie. Okay. And he gives us Pokeballs. Weird flex, but okay. No, get away from us. I just kicked your butt like five seconds ago. Do you want more? You look pretty pleased about something, Taco. Oh, you beat another trainer? Good job. Well, since we're on the topic, the Pokemon you sent into battle might have lost some HP or PP. You should take them to a Pokemon Center. Thanks for the tip. I will use that every once in a blue moon. <laughs> Sniffle. <laughs> uh, I wonder what it's like if we try to... Alright, so here's, here's my age showing back in however young I was when I played this game for the first time. There was an item here. And it's still there. Good to know. Good to know. I am kind of glad that this game exists, so despite my initial reactions, so far I'm pretty positive on it. Um, but it just makes you think that there is an entire generation of kids that never touched Gen 1. And you should always go back to your roots. So I'm just... Hello? Who was there? Nidoran and girl? No, 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 no. So, just my... Oh, hey, Taco. What's up? You're hoping to make it to the Pokemon League someday, too? Uh, that's where all the battles... Yeah. Uh, are you gonna... Um, battle me? Yeah! Wow! Okay. So he does just battle me right off the bat. And I am very, very unprepared for this. So Pidgey's the first one, so that's good. We'll get a good amount of EXP off this first fight. But his Pokemon on the first battle was just as strong as mine is right now. So I am a little worried. Because who knows? Maybe this game will have some challenge. I mean, I would appreciate it. Alright, and it's about to send out Eevee. I'm going to switch Pokemon into uh, Pidgey. Hey, Pikachu just runs back. That's adorable. I love that. I love it. And Eevee, you're out. Cool. Let's tackle you. After you tackle us for <laughs> most of our health. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Alright, Pidgey's out. Oof. And what level is it? Um... Okay, so it's got some stats that you can see off there. It's level 7. And, oh, Oddish is not happy. Oddish is out here to, you know, take some names. Oh, wait. Oh, no, wait. Mm, that was a bad play on my part. And it hit with a crit. Of course it did. Because why wouldn't it? So I totally thought, you know, I'll growth, I'll get that boost in attacking power. But then it gets a crit. So, like, why do I try? <laughs> Gosh, this this Eevee, this trainer, he's kicking my butt. I wasn't expecting this. All right, I'm gonna give it a shot. And fight to uh, Thunder Shock. Quick attack. Still did a good amount of damage to us, but um. And we got the paralysis. Not even bad. Not bad at all. Uh, so yeah, let's try and... You know what? Challenge it. It's there. Uh, maybe because I'm underprepared. But we... Uh, I am just paranoid now that he's going to get another crit for no reason. So let's uh, use up one of those potions. I love this layout. This layout is fantastic. I'm digging it, I'm digging it.
Yo, and we got the lucky uh, paralysis turn as well. Not bad, not bad. Sparky, you're doing good work, Sparky. I appreciate you. Alright, Eevee fainted. Oh, poor little Eevee. I heard that and I felt it in my soul. <laughs> Sparky, level 7. Hey, we're catching up, Andro. Even though we pretty much beat you only because of that paralysis. Kinda lucky on my part. Kinda really lucky. Hmm. Maybe better than like this is just helping you get stronger, huh, Taco? Well, hey, that works too. Let's train hard so we both make it into the Pokemon League. God, I miss when your rival was a dick to you. Like, he used to be so mean. And now he's just so nice, and it's really awkward. Hey, Pikachu, is there anything in these bushes? No? Alright, whatever. Oh, there's a Nidoran male and female over there. Oh, what's that? That little Pikachu icon in the bottom left corner. Oh, Pikachu's boxing out here! Quite confidence. Hey, you just want to play? That's it? Just... Sure, whatever works, buddy. Uh, give your Pokemon the berry. Your berry with ZR or A button bring it over Sparky's mouth. Well, we have like 21 of these, so... Hey, eat it up, eat it up, hey! Whatever. Fun little distractions, not my cup of tea. But anyways, back to Viridian City. And Team Rocket's gone. And by <laughs> by relation, I'm going to be gone too. I'm going to go ahead and heal up the Pokemon. And as many of you know, I work the night shift. Young, but I'm making millions to work the night shift, except I'm not making millions. I'm actually struggling. <laughs> That's why I work the night shift, people. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and get off. And I hope you guys enjoy the flood of Pokemon content you're going to see all over Twitch and YouTube and all of social media. I will catch you guys on the next one. Stay frosty, people. Thumbs if you liked it. Subs if you loved it. Because we're so close to 100. I'm not one to make New Year's resolutions. But when this year started, my one and only resolution was to get my YouTube up to 100 subs. So if you guys could make that possible, I would probably cry tears of soy. Mwah! Much love! <laughs>